After sailing the Elf 26 along the Romanian coast, almost as far as Bulgaria, which is not very far away from Mangalia, we headed back into the port of Mangalia and onto Lake Mangalia so that we could anchor because I wanted to see how the Elf 26 is anchored, how the anchoring system works. In order to anchor, in Lake Mangalia, we had to pass underneath this bridge. So we goose winged our way up toward it and kept a close eye on the mast, which begged the question, how high is the mast on the Elf 26? What is the air draft? And it turns out to be 12 and a half meters, which fortunately is low enough that we could get underneath it. <coughs> In this locker we have uh, 25 meters of chain and another uh, 25 meters of uh, rope attached to the chain who coming through this uh, Lumar 1000 Pro uh, windlass from the Delta anchor on the front of the mast beam. After we recovered the chain through the uh, windlass, we did not um, uh, arrange the chain. This is how the uh, windlass throwing the chain uh, inside of the locker. And on the port side of the mast, opposite the chain locker, you can see here the NMEA 2000 uh, network for Garmin um, instruments. The deep cycle uh, battery here we have uh, uh, 100 uh, gel battery, 100 amps gel battery, and the entire uh, wiring, which can be uh, easily uh, dismounted, easily dismounted in case you want to disassemble the boat. All you have to do is unplug these. You don't need to be a naval engineer or uh, to have uh, many years experience in boat building to put together or disassemble this boat. It's very easy to do. Now, in the morning, when we were getting ready to go sailing, Christian showed me the bridle for the anchor. Uh, I knew immediately what it was, but I neglected to take any video of it and I forgot to ask him how he used it when we came to do the anchoring. So that'll have to be a video for another day. So thanks for watching. If you like what you've seen, then please give us the thumbs up and leave your comments below and subscribe to this channel. Check out other videos about the Elf 26 and other boats on this channel. And if you want to buy an Elf 26 or any other boat, then we probably need to talk. A phone conversation is always better than email or chat.